what is up guys this is karan here welcome back to tech karan youtube channel resurrection remix latest special edition room is available here is it really special and which are the special things you get here and is it really good to install right now on your xiaomi device like redmi note 9 pro redmi note 9 has some poco devices also this is a mere tall edition room so it's a unified room can be installed on all of the devices and single time a single build the link for this build is in the description along said with the installation in this video i'm gonna share with you so you can install that was the things you get here really a customizable room here a special edition room let's get started let's quickly find out how this room is for xiaomi devices well guys first of all if we're gonna talk about this room this one is actually resurrection remix some things are changed here it's not the unofficial build it's not the official build it's a special edition room where first of all we have the launcher pre-installed it does not come with the trebuchet launcher which is available by default in a resurrection remix room it has a launcher launcher pre-installed have a lot of customization features you already know about like the themes desktop customizations dock app drawer and a little bit of more things here and there I have applied the latest Google Pixel 5 live wallpaper on my device which looks very interesting and if you don't know how to install this the link for this wallpaper and some other wallpapers from Pixel 5 is in the description and if you have followed me on telegram you already got to know about these wallpapers which you can install right now by going here and go to styles and wallpapers. Also, let me tell you one more thing if you go to the on device wallpapers we have a lot of wallpapers options available which looks very very interesting as you can see a lot of cool kind of resurrection remix cool looking wallpapers are available here which you can install directly this one is one of my favorite wallpaper out there if i go to set wallpapers home screen and lock scene and as you can see the wallpaper looks very very interesting and seems really nice you can install this build right now on a device let me show you one more thing if you're able to see we have the Dolby audio available too so yes we can use the Dolby audio also without installing it as manually thing it's very beautifully working perfectly fine pre-installed looks kind of very interesting thing this is also one of the thing behind this special edition build also it does not come with the resurrection remix boot animation it has a google boot animation so almost every pixel features and pixel kind of look is available here talking about your quick settings actually i have applied the gradient ascent color as you can see the brightness lighter looks damn interesting which you can customize in your resurrection remix room we already know the header customization is available to resurrection remix is written there you can customize the rows and columns if you want to we have the fps info available which you can see at the top or top left of your quick settings or status bar it looks cam interesting too we have a lot of tiles configurations high accuracy or whatever else we want to do we can choose those kind of things let me tell you some little bit of more things about this special edition room we have some xiaomi parts option where we have the mean sound enhancer which is quite impressive we have the enable touch boost option where you can boost the cpu when touch detected for the smooth experience display color calibration calibrate display using kcal fps info overlay xiaomi dose ambient display gestures clear speakers Linux mode enable usb fast charge these are some cool kind of features which you get pre-installed and this is on the cool highlights of this build and resurrection remix official room already has a lot of customizations which you already know about i think and if we go to this security tab we have very cool kind of thing also let me tell you one more thing we have this screen lock pattern we have the fingerprint lock we have the face lock we have the app lock so all the cool security kind of things are available here we can choose the face lock we can choose the app locker which is perfectly fine here in my case i'm not using it by the way but it should work perfectly fine here like this we have all the apps available which we can lock with the app locker pre-installed looks very interesting also sound display kind of things are available and looks very interesting we have the display settings which have the adaptive brightness styles and wallpapers where you can customize a lot of styles i have applied the default gradient one with red and blue looks interesting you can also customize that by clicking on custom here you have a lot of fonts to customize also it's a fully customizable room as you can see a lot means a lot you can choose any fonts from here every font is looking kind of very interesting but these are not actually we will not see these fonts everywhere 
we have these fonts available only on our screen sometimes not in all the apps not universal this is a little bit of disappointing thing in my case we have a little bit of clock customizations options available too like the type center and ASIN type binary bubble custom number looks better and interesting by the way like this one is cool interesting we have the dot one option available too which you can enable directly from here we have the grid options and these kind of things you get here screen attention colors and a lot more things these are all the features i just wanted to share with you and if we talk about the resurrection tools we cannot see all these features because these are enough clock, network customizations, logo, system icon, system bar, status bar, weather, a lot more things like the quick setting panel, system, interface. These are some a lot which cannot be even be covered in a single video. You can understand these kind of features are a lot. These are not only these kind of if we choose here, we have other options available too. If we choose parts, we have other parts, we have sound, suspend action. So there are a lot of customization some features are of course some useless kind of things are available too but this is quite great and quite beautiful you should definitely try it out if you want to okay these were the things i just wanted to share with you dolby audio pre-installed pre-installed wallpapers and a lot more things in a special edition room which you can use if you want to all the things i just wanted to share with you i already shown you so let's move on to the installation process right now Okay, so let's move on to the custom recovery. In my case, I'm using TWRP latest 3.4.1 beta 0530 for Redmi Note 9S. What you have to do is you have to go to the wipe section first of all. Go to the advanced wipe option. Just choose the Dalvik data and catch these three options and swipe to wipe. It will not take that much time. So just wait for it to complete to just complete format all of these things. After that, just go to the install option here and here locate the file which you have i'll provide the link in the description for the file and the file should be like this rros v 8.6.1 mia tool special edition so swipe to confirm flash it will take some time to flash so just wait for this flash to finish and after this after this done i'll come back to you very very soon Oh guys, after everything should be done, you will see a little bit of these kind of things which does not matter by the way, maybe in your case it will not show you. After that, what we have to do is, let me tell you one more thing, just go to the install option, just follow all my steps, okay? You have to install latest Magisk v20.4 or v21.0, whatever else you want to do. Don't install Google Apps, first of all, you have to install this, but wait, let me show you one more thing. Just go here, just go here, go to the wipe and format data. First of all, you have to wipe format while you have to format your data once after installing the room. Firstly, install the room. After that, format your data. After that, just go to the install option and install Magisk V20.4 or 21.0, the latest one which is available for you. Okay, so it is showing me this kind of error. Let me show you one more thing. We have to reboot to recovery once. So let me reboot to recovery once. So we have just rebooted to recovery once again. So just swipe to install this latest Magisk V21.0 in my case. Okay, it's now installing. It will not take that much time. So just follow all my steps. First of all, just install the room. After that, format that data. And then you have to install the Magisk. And then you have to go here. And then you have to install the Google Apps if you want to of your choice. In my case, I'm using the Pico package right now. So just install this and after that simply reboot your device everything should be done this was quite easy to install this build right now on a device and if this helps you make sure to drop a like and also if you like this don't forget to share this also this was all thanks for watching goodbye